two, one. Hello, hello, hello. Well, here we are. It's another Tuesday already. And I, I was actually um, saying to myself, but I've already painted once this week. But I want to paint more. So we're coming up on some nice bright uh, Easter things and some bright sky and some brushes. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And uh, we're going to knock out some greens and some grass and some, I'm not sure what, but we're going to have fun. I am enjoying myself. God is good. The world is, is doing great. And we're a part of what's going on. Yep. Ooh, we're a little clogged this week. Didn't want to give that paint up out of there. There he goes. Ooh, we're still clogged. Uh-oh. Didn't close that one tight, I guess. So, anyway. Hi, Ann. Hi, Ann. Has everybody been having fun looking at all this stuff on the TV when it comes to... Ann said she had her blessed day. Yes, so did I. So did I. I had a, a great day. And... And we don't want to be sitting around. We want to do something. One of the things that makes a, a good self-employed person is that you like to do things. You like to get stuff done. And uh, when you're self-employed, it's amazing how nothing happens when you're not there. So I certainly do enjoy um, being self-employed. And I enjoy... Uh, getting stuff done and but doing it all see when you're self-employed you have to do it all as a painter you can have some people do the painting some people do the prep some people do the buying and the you know all these kind of things but when you are the man and you do it all then uh then you could be self-employed you have to oh. Hi, Jimmy. oh hey there's my front row you will always be, always have been, always will be, my friend. <laughs> Donnie's going to do another Easter painting today. It'll be different than, he, than the, yep. the one he did the other day that we gave away last night. It'll be different. Completely different. Completely, sort of. Yep. Don't you just love my easel? Doesn't that just like the coolest thing? <laughs> I am so. Sometimes get stuck to it at the bottom, like. <laughs> yeah, things get stuck at the bottom. Oh, I just heard the husky move sound a little bit. Like maybe she's wanting to come in. I had left her out, but she'll be all right. We'll find out. She'll complain Can some you more. Chair just slightly up because you got a paintbrush in your hand. I don't want you breaking it. There you go. Thank you. I don't want to hurt your fingers either. Oh, we're going to do some brights and lights and, and uh, darned if my, I'm looking for something to unclog my white paint. Oh, there we go. That's one thing nice about wearing paint clothes. I can just wipe off my brushes right on my sleeves as I need more. Hmm. Well, whatever's clogging the hole came back as soon as I unclogged it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we're starting out with a different blue. And then we're going to take that blue up into the first blue until we get our beautiful sky. One more time down low. And let's take that little dab right there. Right there. Oh, how'd you get in there? There we go. Look at that. 
And that's true. I have seen some green clouds in the sky, depending on what they're reflecting on. I've seen some some uh, different things. We could, um, yeah, because see, um, I am, as soon as that's dry. Matter of fact, I think that's a, a bit too much, come to think of it. I'm getting all excited and putting on too much paint. And then it takes too long to dry for us to get back to our painting. So we're just going to take some off there. And okay. There we go. That is the color. See how that's got a little bit of that? I'm looking for more of that. I think that's what I want right in there. Because that is light blue. The light blue. We want to spot. We want to spot those places in the sky. Because that's what skies do. Skies have spots of light. They have spots of dark. Especially as they go towards the horizon. Okay, and then we're going to put a little bit of white right in there, and some right there, and some right there, and that's good, that's good, that's good. Then we're going to, the roly-poly brushes are heading for the paint, got to stop them from getting there. Ah, here we go. Oh, look at that. There we go. All right, that brush is in the fire. We are all done with that one. I want to make sure I've got this dry down here. Because we're going to do springtime flowers. And like a sunset coming up in the distance. Mm -hmm. And the gold above that right there. That's good. Rinse that one a little bit. We want to do one more right there. Actually be better what do you say we do a we might just do like a golden golden meadow how about if we do a golden meadow let's start bringing the, the green because I mixed um uh, was that blue and yellow makes green yeah blue and yellow so the blue and the yellow kind of mixed together and made it green. So we're going to just go ahead and go ahead with that green. <laughs> Get these sides. Okay. All right. Switching brushes again. Because I think what happened up here was this bright yellow Look at all those colorful hearts. Hey Rhonda. Um Bear Hug and everyone I was wasn't 
So Spaceman, um, Spaceman Dudley had just texted about a half an hour before um, we went live. And um, he said that um, please uh, pray for Becky. Um, uh, she had to be taken. He had to take her to the emergency room. So, and she has dealt with health issues on and off. And um, I think the, uh, the CV, uh, Spaceman Dudley's dealt with them too, different kinds of health issues. But I think the CV, um, uh, both had affected them both and um, in a uh, negative way on their health. So they could use the prayers because, you know, that has uh, harmed a lot of people, the CV, in, in their health, you know. So we just uh, appreciate the prayers for um, Spaceman and Becky. Russo said, I like it already. It's like the colors of uh, Slava, Ukraine. <laughs> <laughs> we have a friend in Ukraine but by the name of Viktor Petrenko. He is a pastor. He's actually been up in Denmark since they had to, you know, escape. But uh, we've known him since um, 1997. His wife's Tatiana. I have him on Facebook if you would like to know where he's at on Facebook. I do have him on Facebook. He preaches, though, in the native language, and we don't. Right. He's mostly speaking in Russian. Yeah, so we don't understand what he says. <laughs> we just hit the like button. Because <laughs> we, he, when he's talking to us personally, he'll talk in, in English, but when he's on Facebook, he's ministering to his people. Yep. You know, that understand his native language, so we just are like, we know he's preaching something about Jesus, so we hit the like button. <laughs> Give him a heart or something. And... Yep. And hope that he is safe in the Ukraine. Hmm. school with him and we um uh donnie let him use um our car because he had no transportation to get around for him and his family for the year that he was there at bible school mm -hmm. we even let somebody else use that car the very next year too See, a lot of people don't know. <laughs> there's people that, you know, they can... Um, there's people out there that'll misjudge you if you allow yourself to receive a blessing. It took a long time for us to be able to receive blessings from people because um, we always were in the thing of, like, blessing other people. We, we loan... We took in Bible school students and everything. Because people, if people look, there's people that are so, um, they're so not givers that they will be uh, seriously offended if somebody allows themselves to receive a blessing. You know? Um, they're so offended by that because they're just, you know, they just don't want to give God nothing. They hold on to their dollar so tight. You know what I mean? And so, but we've always been givers. Ever since Donnie met and I met, we've been givers. And we have loaned out our cars for like a year at a time to, yep. to, to Victor Petrenko. And he was a pastor, like, you know, from the Ukraine. 
um, uh, we had another, um, we had an, an um, African American um, uh, that we helped put through Bible school, and he and we loaned him our car, and he lived with us. Yeah. And stuff. So, so he could he could work. Students live with us. He he went to work stuff, in our car. You know. Um, my, uh, th these are the things that we did because we had the ability to do it. You know, we, we, um, at w every chance we get, if we can, we're a blessing. That's why we give away Donnie's paintings too. We, we, we can't store them. We're, we're in this RV. You know, we hope to have a home some, sometime so that he can do, um, you know, the oil painting and stuff. And then he'll be able to, um, let it dry and finish and stuff and maybe he gets lessons or something he might then he then he might um you know be able to put some up for sale if he gets better at it you know learns how to do that and stuff but people will will mock you and misjudge you and say all kinds of things if they're if they're tight wads <laughs> and they don't and they're offended by by anything because donnie and i have the membership thing and stuff on our channels but we don't like it's it's there, but we don't sit there, and uh, we're still givers despite that. You know what I mean? We are givers, and we've always been givers and stuff. So, but um, but yeah, this you know, we it, we just let God deal with our heart when it turns to that. You know what I mean? We've been giving to people for so many years and things like that. And there's been times when we gave to somebody, and. The Bible says you have to like, um, you have to let your seed die when you give to somebody, and not yeah, don't expect it, and don't and don't expect something from it because if you plant, it's like if you plant a, um, you know, like a farmer plants a seed because my family's farmer. If you plant a seed, you have to let that seed die, you know, so that it can sprout. You can't um, uh, turn around and dig it back up. You have to let it go. You plant your seed and you let it go. Yeah, then forget about and it. And then you pray to the Lord that it'll be a blessing, you know, and that the Lord will bless you back, you know. So mm -hmm. that that's that's kind of the way we we um, do it. I've heard I've heard a lot of ministers say you can't outgive God, you know, because God will turn around and bless you back if you're if you're a blessing to people and stuff yeah so, betcha it actually makes us feel good every time we <laughs> we give away a painting for me it does it makes me feel good sometimes donnie feels i like, miss a few paintings sometimes donnie feels a little <laughs> attached to his paintings he's not ready. He's not ready. i missed that one he's like, that one sunset painting i still miss that one he's like oh but we don't have room to put them here no nope. i miss we don't have them. But that's another thing God planned, you know. Like, well, I'd hold on to them if I had a place to put them. Since I don't have any place to put them, I don't hold on to them. I really, really want maybe red. I need, like, my, my fire engine red. Hmm. Yeah, I am uh, trying to work out this painting. What I want to do with it. And I don't really see it yet. Nice, Marisa, that's soft, coming to life already. nice soft brush. Thank you so much. I'm, I am trying to breathe some life into it right now. Hmm.
Sometimes I get messed up and I start working on the foreground, forgetting to put something in the background. And uh, I wanted to... Okay, so that's going to be that. So what I'm doing is I'm looking for my flowers and my distant it's almost like a field of a field of flowers it's, it's still too much paint on that brush look there we go how about that field of flowers i'm trying to get a field of flowers going here and it's messing me up let's see if it that's all right, but I need, you know, it's not just about getting the paint color and all that. It's about getting the, um, the, Hi, the background and, and getting the right paintbrush. I have to have a paintbrush do the right thing for me here. Huga said pretty colors. Hello, Huga. Huga, Huga, Huga. We want a Huga, Huga, Huga. Yeah, I think I like that. And then we're going to put in some red flowers. Okay. Let's get our white and our red and our green. And we're going to put in some green down here. And we Thank also you, Jared, need... Hey, that's right. We've got some sharers in our group. Share shares it. And um, uh, Rondo shared it to seven people last week. That was very sweet. Very sweet. We like to be a blessing. Anybody that came in here, um, that just came in, if, if they didn't hear me say, Spaceman um, Dudley had... Um, texted me about a half an hour before Don started the live stream, and um, uh, he had taken uh, Becky to the emergency room, and he said um, uh, he was requesting prayers, so I told him that I would let let everybody know so that they could um, pray for him and her. And her. She's the one Thank you, Jesus. Room. Thank you, Jesus. Bless you. Jeremy said, thank you so much for the car event of Mustangs. Thank you for watching. Oh, thank Donnie you. Did the, the live, that did a, um, a live stream of it, and uh, he had fun. He had a blast, and while he was doing that, I was walking around vlogging it. So um, he did the vertical live stream, and I did a horizontal video. So my video is about an hour and 17 minutes or something, and it's really doesn't um, a full walkthrough. My video is really a full walkthrough of the of the cars and and stuff, and they were beautiful. Yeah, that was so much fun. Jeremy said prayer sent for. Yes, Miss Becky is healed. And then we're just doing spring flowers here, trying to make a, a few little plants grow. And uh, that's greens and yellows, and then tapping off some of the paint. Thanks, Jeremy. I'm looking at trying to get a little bit more green. How about some red, too? Spaceman's birthday's coming up, too, on Sunday. So we pray they're both healthy and can enjoy um, his birthday. Mm hmm. Nope, that's, well, I guess we could go that bright. And I'm going to pick that up for a minute. 
just a quick second. All right. That looks like enough flowers. We got a little few down here to put in. All right. Hmm. What is he gonna do now? Well, I don't know, but I have a tree on my mind, and I was thinking about several of them. And, uh... I do love it when I can get a tree to work. And we're gonna put those trees right here, down into that ring right there, and one here. And one back in here, a little further away. Rhonda, um, he said, um, he misses his old muscle cars and monster trucks we had uh, as kids, I guess. <laughs> mm hmm Yep, see, and then I can take um, some of this brown, see, and I can make a few little little things in here. There might be a few stems right in here that need to show. We'll put a few here, right under here. That's good. Mm -hmm. And we'll go ahead and put a few more up here. Like that. You can't do the crosses? Yeah. Huh? What's that? You can do the crosses? Crawford. Crosses. Crosses. Um, I'm I'm not there yet. Okay. Um, I'm just making sure. I'm just doing like I, I I wasn't thinking crosses. I was thinking Easter bright flowers, springtime. Okay, because I thought you were gonna put the crosses because you're putting all these trees in there. That's what I'm asking. Yeah. Because that's what we talked about. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I do forget, do don't I? And then you do something else. Yeah. Well, that back mountain, you could do it there. You just make the mountain taller. <laughs> Take away those trees. Hmm. <sighs> well. That's a challenge. <sighs> what shall we do? Well, I think I'm... That's not the right brush for that. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know, sweetheart. I don't know. <sighs> That's not dry yet. But we can go ahead and we can go ahead and smush that out. And uh just make that 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 one on the right. I'm doing on the right, yeah. Yeah, just a little, a little mm -hmm. taller and then just put the three crosses on the top of it. Yep. Amazing a mountain appears. Because he once he started painting, his imagination went with him and he forgot what we talked about. <laughs> well, I appreciate you understanding that. Not a lot of people do. That's but that's why God picked you for my wife. I tell you. Yeah. She's she's got a lot of understanding for me. Got me through a lot of junk. 
All right, well, let's go ahead and put a few trees here like that and up here and then we're going to take uh, here don't make tall trees because you're going to do the crop three yeah, I'm doing three crosses up yeah. here. Boy, that ain't working out. I don't think you should paint with that. Well, it's a good thing for... I mean, Bob does his trees with this blade, but of course he uses oil. So it's, maybe that's why it's... I'm just going to get out my favorite brush. It always never lets me down and do do verticals with that. Probably not. They probably didn't see that. What? No, I saw it on the camera, so yeah. therefore they had to see it. Oh right, there's my pants right there, yeah. That's good old painter pants. That's why they're called painter <laughs> pants. Okay, now we need to go back to that brush. Where's that brush? Is that that brush? <laughs> okay. We're going to take a combination of, um, of greens and stuff, and we are going to build a little bit of a brown... thing right here and then we're going to take this black brown we're going to do that Gonna put some rough realism in here. We could put a few little bumpy dumpy jumpy jumpy right there. Okay. Back to the brown. Put the brown right in there. <laughs> and gotta fix.
fix that spot right there. Bring that down. So we're putting a little stair right like that. Doing some brown and some yellow and some green to see what we can make look real. And some plants, a few. I have a Easter story, too, I want to tell you, called Forgiveness in the Spring. Yeah, that, some people don't like that one. Yeah. Because it's... Yeah, so, we've got to figure out, make that just a video that people can choose to watch. Got some brown, got some green, just a touch of yellow. And then we'll put a few, we'll put a few little plants right up in here. That are trying to grow on a hill that called Golgotha. Maybe we should accentuate this path a little bit, huh? Fairfax said I'll look forward to watching it and hearing the story. It's a sad animal story, and so not everybody likes that. And that's why I said, I, you know, said... Can't do it on the live he stream. He sometimes will start telling a story like that on a live stream, and then people will stop watching because they're like, I'm out of here, I don't like these stories. And they won't watch no more. And I mean, no more. Yeah. I mean, they never came back. And that's kind of sad, but... What can you do? That's all we can do is, you know. And of course, if, if I felt like God told me to say this, and it was very important, and I needed to say it, I would. But it's just kind of, it's just a story that I like to tell because it really touched me and changed my life in a lot of ways um, years ago. And we all need to have life-changing things happen to us. So that we can have, you know, a new life. The Bible says we're new creatures, new creations. That we are infused with God. It's not just, God is not just a cologne that washes off. He's infused into our blood. He is infused into our skin. He is in us. Hi, Maritza.
when Jesus did this and went through this, not because we were sinners. He had to do it because we were sinners, but that's not why he went through it. It says in the Bible, he went through this for the joy. He went through this for the joy of knowing that this would set us free from sin, that this would allow us to have a relationship with him, that this was what we needed to be free and to be with him. And he wanted us to be with him so bad that he was willing to go through all of this just to get us there with him. We probably could use a few lighter color, maybe some beigey brown rocks up here. Just a little brighter, maybe a little green. Right around the base there. And some black. Okay, now the brush bites the dust. Next and I think Tuesday is my birthday. So we might we're gonna be in Gatlinburg. Uh, we have a hotel for um, for Tuesday night. So we might do a um, we might do a live stream from um, Smoke Mountain Glass. Um, we have a signal and all that. Mm, signal. Yeah, signals. Signals. Because he's not going to bring all his painting supplies over there. <laughs> oh, we were thinking about that though. I don't think so. It's your birthday, not mine. Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> oh, I found my long, my long branch, bristle, long branch, bristle brush the other day. Remember, I was looking for it. I was like, so where is my long branch bristle brush? Well, I found it. And, uh, it's definitely there. And, mm -hmm. I almost was almost painted a sequoia there. I was wanting to do one of those one of these days. Well, you have to fix that one painting. Huh? That one painting, that one. Uh... Yeah, that we decided to make it a sequoia, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know where that's at at the moment, but. It's up on top of the refrigerator. Okay. Now, you know, springtime, my mm -hmm. leaves are not real heavy yet. That's one thing that I really like about that boat painting that I did. Was that boat painting was so simple. So simple. And I overcomplicate things and put too much paint on the board. And 
And it's like, that's really simple. Erica, that would be exciting to watch if you can get a signal. Yeah. Because the, the motel's not like on a creek, right? It is. Yeah, so we're hoping to be able to get a good, you know, we'll get a good log of the creek, but hopefully we'll get a... Maybe we should make that like that a dead one, huh? They have had bears in that in that um, mountain mountain stream up there. Um, I don't know if they would be there the night we're going to be there or not, but yeah. it would be exciting. Mothers and cubs start coming out end of it's February, beginning of April. I yeah. mean, April. End of March, beginning of April, they do come out. That's when we got our best shots. We'll probably do the Motor Nature Trail and see what kind of bear activities up there. We haven't been to the falls yet, so... I don't know if we'll do it that day because I kind of want to enjoy the hotel. Oh, uh, okay. But I'm not wanting to just drive. You don't want to go anywhere. And drive everywhere because we can do that all the time. Oh well, okay. One of the reasons why we booked a hotel for my birthday is because I don't want to spend my birthday in this RV. <laughs> This brush is not acting like it's supposed to. Hmm. That's not the right brush. That's the one Bob uses. <laughs> Bearhug said, oh, maybe see a few adorable bears at a safe distance. <laughs> I adore you from a distance. That's for sure. Still not quite, quite what I want. Lighter, it's lighter. Yeah. It's not dark. the The new leaves are light. Mm-hmm. Hey, Lake Aikens. Said good job, Bonnie. Hey, good to see ya. We're dabbing in the yellow and dabbing in the green and heading up the tree. Hopefully we're hitting the right, the right chords as we go. Okay. We'll make this tree a little bit like a different, a different um, one altogether. You know, it's not the same make, make and model. And then we'll go back to this tree. That okay. one looks like a pine tree almost. Well, almost. Good, well, at least I'm, I'm hitting the numbers here of what I wanted. Aha! Uh -huh. Mr. Yellow rolled away and I found him. <laughs> hmm. Man, that's kind of bright orange. I might like that. And where's green? Green, green, green. Lake Aiken said he's on the job. He dropped in to say hi. Yeah, he was here the other night too. I appreciate you coming in while you're working. I'm glad you're able to do that. 
and get a chance to think about something else for a minute. And, and you can keep uh, uh, Spaceman, Spaceman, yeah. Spaceman Dudley's uh, wife, Becky, in prayers. He had to take her to the ER. Yep, we are getting our branches organized here, doing a good job. Down lower is a little darker because it's in the shade. There we go. And we're just going to fill in a few more here. One or two right at the top. Couple of branches up there reaching for the sky. And right here. Oh, that needs more green. A little bit more green right there. Yep, we like that one. We like that one. I think. We could use a little bit more up here. A little bit more, a little bit more greenery right in here. Yep. Because see, you have to do some dark branches because the darker branches are behind. They, they're just the same color, but of course they don't get the same light. So they have to be just a few dark ones. Blake said he's actually um, waiting for a truck to show up. And there it is. Ta-da! That's what makes him so strong. He's driving unloading trucks, huh? He's unloading a, a box of Kenny. <laughs> All right. Putting that brush in the sauce. Now we've got to get back to that um, Okay. So now we're going to go for our our tree trunks here or need to be finished. Mm -hmm. Oh. There are some good movies that have great theme music that just motivates me to paint. Hi, Cher. Hey, Cher. Um, Cher Spaceman had texted me um, about a half hour before Donnie went live. He had to take um, his wife, Becky, to the ER, so he asked for prayers. told him I would um, let everyone know so that everyone could be praying. Thank you, Jesus. Luke 10, 19. We tread upon serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and nothing by any means shall harm us. And... If you start saying that before you have an issue, that issue may never show up. Start confessing your faith and your belief in God before trouble comes. Don't treat God like a jacket that you only put on when it's cold. And you will be... That being said, well the prayers of agreement are very much... A blessing according to the Bible. Yes, and we agree. Mm 
And that looks like a I really like the way these tree trunks came out. They, I did them with just mixing the colors on my brush and then pulling it down. And it's got a dark and a light and it's got lines in it. And it's just beautiful. Just a beautiful trunk. And I'm trying to recreate that trunk color as I complete it. And it's not coming together yet. So I'm mixing the brown and the white to see if I can find that tree color. It looks like it's got some green in it too, huh? Oh, I think I got it. That looks pretty good. I'm going to put some on that tree. And then we're going to put some on this tree. Yeah, we've got to put just a, just a little bit of life on one side of the tree. A little bit of light. There we go. There we go. That looks good. said she agrees it's beautiful trunks and trees yeah they just they look really good hey Suzanne she said it's beautiful Real pretty. And I'm going to finish that trunk right there. Oh, boy. Look at that. This tree's got a little bit more he's got to have done. There, that just brought that tree forward into the garden here. Well, that's good. And then this one, we're going to bury it a little bit in some weeds. Push that one back a little bit. Like that, and that one's good, and this one looks pretty good. We're just about done here. Maybe I need to see a little bit of something. And that's a little bit too much. We're going to blend that in a little. We need some brown. Sometimes I actually have to have somebody holler stop at me. <laughs> Otherwise I'll keep messing with something and, oh, I had it and then I lost it. Because to me, I'm, I'm doing the same thing you are. I'm watching things create in front of my eyes. And if I'm not careful, I lose it. I mean, I, I pass it by. I do too many colors, too much color, and then all of a sudden I've lost it. And I have to be really careful. There we go. I think we're going to let that one play right there. Just a touch of white right down here. Oh, that looks good. And look how this, this root is reaching down into the garden. And then this root over here is going to have some of the flower. 
some of the flower color on it right here. And we're going to hit the red and we're going to hit the orange. And we're going to blend those two right into here. Bring that. Boy, isn't that pretty. We'll bring that right down. Pretty spring flowers. Pretty spring flowers coming right down the hill right there towards us. Little tiny ones. A little bit of red, a little bit of the orange. And we seem to be getting some beautiful flowers right here. Now let's go ahead and what we'll do is we'll see. Oh, boy, that's really something. I'm going back to the orange, touching the red. And let's bring a few more flowers into these duller areas. Right there. Yep. Now I'm going to chase those other ones with the yellow. So now I'm going to take some bright yellow. Just on the tip of the brush. And see if I can't get the tips of these flowers right there. Yeah, because see, t flowers are tall. Some flowers are very tall and only the top. Only the top is bright. See, so if we do that and then we come down here, even stair step a little bit, bring those across. And we'd go to the, um, the yellow. And then uh, we kind of, let's see, where else should we put some yellow? How about right there? We'll put some. Let's get some more yellow flowers up here. And let's put a few little yellow tops in with these red flowers. Okay. And let's come over here and put a few, a few, red, few, few, few yellow flowers in here. Okay, we need something right here. Let's see, I'm gonna do green and yellow and a touch of red all together. So I'm gonna do green, yellow, and touch of red all together to see if I can see if I can create something in here. Kind of brighten this up a little bit. All right. Okay. So we're going to take a little black and a little gray. The spaceman it... said he came in and he said, Hi, y'all. Hey. Out of the ER. Good. Already home, both of you? He said, not sure what caused her issue, possibly a kidney stone. Yeah, we asked everyone to pray, spaceman. Yes. We're just going to put in a few shadowy rocks right here. Just a few... Stones. Just something for contrast. 
a little buildup of rocks that have flowers on them. And, uh, oh, that looks good. I think we need one more little set of stones right here. bit there's a good stone okay yep and the touch of white just gives it a little contrast mm, that's too much And then you just touch that stone with a little bit of white. Boy, that looks good. And I think we need a little bit more dark. A little bit more. On Speak this. then said they have to drive about 20 minutes to find a pharmacy that has later hours because we don't have it in his town. Yeah. Bear oh. said, so glad they have something with later hours for you, but wish it was closer. He's got to uh, go charge his phone now. Thanks for uh, letting us know, spaceman. That everything's okay. We're praying. Hugs to Becky. And as you can see, I'm touching a few branches up into the tree to show the leaves have support. They're not just hanging there on their own. <laughs> just kind of having a little breakthrough right there. Like Joy said, it's early in the year. Take care, spaceman. Have a good night. Get good restful sleep for you and Becky. Continued prayers. Yep. Suzanne is sending Becky good wishes too. So now I'm I'm kind of building up a little shadow here. I saw a plant. I saw a plant. And plants have to have a little shadow and a little stem. This right here doesn't make a whole lot of sense. We'll have to see if we can't put something right there. I'm gonna take some red and some green. Looks like we need the yellow too. That kind of brightened that up area. That brightened that area up real nice. Okay. Done with that brush. Ah, what shall we make our? Let's make our thing with the with the burner brush. I'd really like the um, the trees. 
and some of the things that have showed up on my pad as I'm painting on my easel. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a little dark, a little red, a little dark red. Then we're going to add some black and we're going to do this like that. Just like that. Then we clean that brush a little bit. And we let that dry. Oh mm, boy. All right. And we're going to add some more bright reds into our flowers here. And bring those down. Yeah. And we're going to bring those over here like that. Brighten it up with that. We might even put a few little, little red dancers in among the rocks. Because this, the paint, when you first put it down, it's like, oh, that's too bright. But then as soon as it dries, you think, oh, no, that's not bright enough. So I like that. I like that. And then we're going to take this and we're going to do lighter reds now. See how the dark ones made the light ones jump out? And then there's a little shadow underneath, so we know that's the shadow. And now we're going to touch a few right at the top where the sun will shine. Beautiful. Very pretty. Very nice. And I see, okay, so that's done, that's done, that's done, that's done, that's done. I guess we can put some of that flower color up here. Maybe not that much. That might have been too much. Okay. And then I want to fix that one tree. That one tree needs like a little, a little garden or something under it. We need some greens. And we need to, there we go. See the... There's always something that wants to grow around a tree. So we want to put that in there. Oh, that needs a little yellow. I don't know if I've got any more yellow out or not. Let's see if it comes out. Oh, it did not. And we're just trying to dab a little bit of contrast around that back tree back there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Trying to decide if I've got enough here, done enough here. What else do I need to do here? That helped a little bit right there. One more dab of that green. I like that green. That green really, that really helped. The 
the tree on the right. That tree right there on the right. This next one? to the bush. No, no, no. That's the right. Well, not according to my camera. Oh. This tree? Yes. Okay. That's the right hand tree. Or the right hand of the floor. Yeah. What does it need? Anyway, it seems like it should be rounder. It's got like three tops to it. Seems like you should have it rounder. Okay. It's a little too upward. Alright. A little farther out. Let's see. Green. 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 Still a little wider. And a little rounder at the bottom too. Oh, well, we're it's coming. Just, it doesn't. It didn't have the right shape to it. Mm hmm Then we'll just overrun this other tree and put that other tree behind us. And we'll make this one a little rounder. Getting too busy now. Can't hardly see through it. Let me put it on some more. Alright, so we got our light, see dark green. Alright, so that'll be our light green, but first, I guess we don't have to do that. I could add some white too. Yeah, I was just thinking that because that that would be like a, one of those um, pear trees, those mm -hmm. those pear trees. Hi, Smoky Mountain Man. Um, a spaceman said that he had to take um, Becky to the emergency room, but he he's a uh, she's out now. He, about a half hour before we went live, he had to take her to the emergency room. He texted me and. Um, so she's out now, but um, could use the prayers. He, th he thinks it might be her, her uh, like a kidney stone or something. That makes the other trees look really scant, though. Now I gotta fix them other trees. Hmm. Put a few more branches on these other trees. everyone know when they come in. Nancy, we're praying for um, uh, Miss Becky. Becky, spaceman's spaceman's Becky. He had to take her to the uh, emergency room and um, she's she's you know, either on her way back home or she's home now and um, he thinks it might be like kidney stones or something like that. All this modern medicine and they can't tell you what's wrong with you. It's amazing. It's sad. It's, it, it, a lot of time, a lot of times, it's just guessing. It's looking good. Yep, I'm done. I better stop right there.
Isn't it funny how he goes, I'm done. I better stop right there. And then he grabs a paintbrush. Actually, I was going to sign it, but... My signature went terribly wrong. Smoky Mountain Man said, Prayers for Becky. Father, we lift up Becky to you in Jesus' name. Father, you created Becky's body. You know what is wrong. We ask you in Jesus' name to bring healing and relief. Amen. Amen. Nothing by any means shall harm her. And, and reverse whatever the CV might have done to mess with or the their VA or a VAC either. No, no ill effects from anything that was forced upon her by the society. Even if she had to agree to it, any any we she does not we we do not give it permission to affect her life. Or space man, yeah. Well, that was a good mistake. <sighs> Smoky Mountain Man said, I love that painting, Donnie. The three crosses on the hill remind me of the price paid for our salvation. Yep. And then there's a nice rocky mountain there, like a, like a stone that you see here in the yep. Smokies. Asked Donnie to make a few birthday paintings. <laughs> this one looks like it would be a good birthday painting. Yeah. For, um, well, we also have a live stream Saturday before Easter, so we could also do that, you know. Yeah. This would make well, because we're having um, we're having a birthday party. Um, during the rod run. Yeah, I know. Smoky Mountain Man. You ever, he has a birthday coming up. Mm -hmm. If you were going to be in the area, you could come to the birthday party. <laughs> Lake Aiken said, wow, what a beautiful painting. Thank you, Lake. Thank you for your gifts to us, to me, to paint. Smoky Mountain Man said, beautiful trees, um, the beautiful uh, true salvation. Right. There's two different kinds of trees here. Yeah. The salvation of tree, the salvation tree, yeah. Very good point. Very good point. Yep. And then this we needed a we needed a little bit of trunk right there. Hey, everyone that's here. Po post your um, um, your birthday in the chat because I I forget birthdays I try to put them on a calendar yeah some of them come up naturally on Facebook others don't bear hug said 311 bear hug I got yours on the calendar let's see Smoky Mountain Man is April 21. I got yours on the calendar. Let's see. Sandy said April 18th. Oh, she's another April baby. 
April birthday. Blake said August 20. I'll be 29 again. <laughs> he said. Well, good for him. That's uh, probably the not the Roman calendar. Okay, I'm just touching up my trees a little bit here. Getting a few marks on them to give them a little bit, a few more branches. Right there, how about right there? Okay. Kim B is uh, August 16. Smoky Mountain Man is going to be 62. Lake said I'll be 70. Bear Hug's husband's birthday is August 4th. He listens and watches off my device with me. Now, a mistake I made, I put a little too dark of a green over here, and uh, but now that I'm looking at it, I kind of like it. It's almost like a shadow. She it almost says, looks... I'm three years old, Lake says. I'm three and a half she's years okay, old. Lake, um, Sheila's birthday is one day from yours. It's a is hers the 19th or the 21st? I can't remember. Okay. There you go, people. Thank you so much for being here tonight. I don't know if you had perfect reception or not because we're using a different app and we've been, you know, believing God for, you know, to, for the internet to straighten out. Hi, Angie. So hopefully you had a good picture tonight. Angie said, God has truly blessed you with a gift. This is a beautiful painting. He is risen. And it only took me an hour and a half this time. I'm right at an hour and a half and I'm supposed to do it in an hour like old Bob did, so... But I didn't. And the only thing I was thinking about doing that I didn't do okay, was I'm put a big hole right here and a rock. <clears throat> all right. <coughs> so, are you all done talking about anything coming up or giveaways or anything? I'm right into it. Yeah, we're good. Okay. And, uh, I'm going to try to get him to do some more, um, do some more, um, Paintings. Paintings for the uh, birthdays. Yes. So, and the refrigerator is a really nice painting over here. It's, look at this night sky over here. It's really, really beautiful. <laughs> From all the splatters. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so, we love you, but Jesus loves you more. <laughs> All righty then. So, remember, I love you, but Jesus loves you more than I do. And even though my time is stopping now, his time never stops. He is always with you. We love you. We love you. Good night. Good and, night. And thank you Good for night. those who watch the replay or on hey, TV. Hey, thanks to you. For all of my, you know. Yep, I, my, some of my paintings almost break 100. Thank you. Appreciate that so much. And uh, when they take off, you can say, I knew him when. Because you were here. And uh, sorry you missed our giveaway the other day. But we're going to do more of them. Bless you, bless you. Good night, good night, good night. Bear hugs husband, so it's beautiful. Thank you, thank you all. Good night, good night. Do you want to end the loop too? Yep.